What's happening? 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 Welcome to the Chosen I Take Show. I am your host, Real Raw, aka Chosen I Take, and choose your life. Don't just take what it gives you. And if you could do me a favor, please like, comment, and subscribe to the vibe. And you know what? We in day two of the hundred days of motivation through the Word of God. And today is a very, very simple one. A very, very simple one from a very familiar passage, Proverbs 29 and 18. What do we say? Well, there is no vision. My people perish. Let me explain something to you. What is the vision that you have for your life? Huh? Can we talk? You can have sight and not have vision. Let me say it again for those who didn't catch that. You can have sight. You can see. But that don't mean that you have a vision. Me as a single man, I may see a beautiful woman. But I may not envision her to be my wife. Let me be quiet today because I'm talking too loud. Let me explain something a little bit deeper for those who really are not comprehending what I'm saying. Especially when it comes to relationships. You can see a person, but you won't have a vision for them. I want you to know something. You wake up every single day being able to see all the obstacles in your life. Because you can't see the vision that has that God has for you. Let me say it again. I'm going to be preaching this day. Watch this here. You can wake up every single day and be able to see the obstacles in your life. And they got you down and, 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 and out because you can't see the vision. Notice something. In the book of Habakkuk 2, he did not tell you to uh, write down the sight. Mm-mm. He didn't tell you to write down what you see. Mm-mm. He said, write down the vision. Because when you have vision, you're able to see things that are not there yet. Let me say it again. When you have vision, you're able to see things that are not there yet. Let me encourage you this word. I told you I won't be here long. This is 100 days of motivation without vision. The people perish. And I just want to let you know something. If you don't have a vision for your life, you're living every day with nothing to live for. Let me say it again. When you don't have a vision, you're living every single day with nothing to live for because vision is tied in with your purpose. So let me tell you something. If you don't do nothing else, write down your vision for yourself. And if you don't know what your vision is, seek God, seek him first. And therefore he'll show you your vision because God can show you your vision with your eyes closed. You know what it is? This day number two in the hundred days of motivation. Thank you for subscribing to the video, to, uh, to the YouTube channel. I'm so, so sorry. Uh, look here. We on our way to 10,000. We already at 5,000. We on our way to 10,000. Like, comment, subscribe. And you know what it is. I got three things before I go. God loves you. I love you. And if we keep loving each other, the world is going to be an absolutely wonderful place. Blessings to you.